Yo, what is going on, guys? We're back with another Legends video, and here today, man, we're going to be running the Triple Vegito Blue setup. We can finally do this in the game with the introduction of Ultra Vegito Blue. Now, you know, your boy did go through a bit of a struggle arc for Ultra Vegito, and obviously, if we didn't pull him, we wouldn't be able to, uh, you know, run this team here today. But your boy did get lucky. Again, I am still going for copies. Hopefully, I can get him to 10 stars, but I'll be satisfied with one more copy because we'll have the six stars, the ability, right? Which is pretty, pretty which is pretty good, right? So. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll be satisfied with one copy, but obviously I'm going for two more because 10 stars is like the sweet spot for ultra units, right? Obviously anything after 12 stars is not really that good, right? I, not, I'm not going to say it's not really that good, but it's it's point it, it's it's near pointless because you're just getting a little bit of a stat boost, right? Jumping from 10 to 12 stars, right? If you're going for like, if you go after 10 stars, you might as well just go for the 14 stars, right? That's just the way it is because again, I just don't see a point in just having a 12 star ultra unit, right? So again, it's just better to go for the 14 stars if you're going to go after, after more copies after you get the uh, ultra unit to 10 stars. Now there is ultra Z power now, right? So you actually could just go to 12 stars and then obviously if you're if you know if you're one of those big boy spenders then you um you spend the 2000 z power and you get him to 14 stars right that way you don't have to go for that last copy summoning you can just you know guarantee your way to 14 stars but uh, again it's all you know it's all up to you how you play this game at the end of the day right but again we're here for the triple yo shot team the triple vp team uh i'm not gonna say it should be pretty fun because vegeto blue is probably or ultra vegeto blue then be more specific it's probably gonna be the one that's doing all the work right if not probably he is gonna be the one doing all the work right he's he, that's why we have the double zenkai buffed here we could have just used i guess the blue gogeta right the original transforming gogeta could have used them for a bench for a vb right actually no he's blue movie so actually no we couldn't uh, i mean i guess we could have used namek goku right for of bb because he is blue sands but i just don't think bb will be doing that much right maybe we'll get a nuke out his ultimate right maybe we can nuke ultra vb right the ultra vbs that we fight maybe we could nuke him with blue vbs uh uh the main uh ult right I, i'm over here stuttering and over here having a, literally a brain shut down over here so you know let's uh finish up this intro here obviously purple vb will be doing little to nothing right i don't even think I, I don't even think his ult will hit, right? Like, I just, I don't even know, bro. I just don't see this guy doing anything. But, you know, I guess if he does, I'll be pretty surprised. He's literally just here to fulfill the video requirement, right? To have a triple BB team. I can't wait to uh, get a uh, third BB. I guess it'll be a 1% sparking, right? Because obviously we already have a Legends Limited. We already have Ultra Gogeta Blue. So next up would be a 1% sparking maybe a transforming one i don't know i feel like a transforming one they could save that for like something else but then again i feel like they've drained ultra gogeta blues animations right because uh the lf has the you know the the meteor explosion the kamehameha and then the ultra has like the uh, uh soul punisher right so uh, i don't know what else they could do for him but it is legends right they could just come up with something whatever they uh decide to go with so yeah uh i'll be waiting for the third gogeta blue unit so we can finally run that team but you know here we are here for vegeto blues team so with that being said hope you guys do enjoy if you do hit that like button hit the subscribe button if you're new we are on the road to 1.5k subs all the support is greatly greatly appreciated as always man uh let me know what you guys think about this team down below uh again i just don't expect nothing short of vb or ultra vb again uh being the one to do all the work here so yeah again let me know what you guys think hopefully you guys do enjoy the matches and i'll see you all in the next one I keep forgetting that I have to start making this a habit, but here's the equip uh, list here that we have here. We have the obviously the new platinum. We have this awakened equip for Vegito Blue, and then we have the uh, the all right equip, right, which is giving us almost five percent to pure strike for each fusion warrior member. Which obviously it's a triple BB team, so we'll be completing complete, completing the requirements for that. And then Vegito Blue has the uh, melee equip, this future equip, which gives like a ton of strike attack, yeah, damn near twenty percent. And then obviously this one, which also gives pure strike attack when there's a battle member melee attack, which both UVB and himself, uh, the LFVB is. And then for the purple Vegito Blue, we just have some range equips on him, nothing too crazy. Again, I just don't, I, I don't expect nothing from this guy, but if he does. You know, if he gets his little moment, then so be it. But if not, I'll just leave everything up to Ultra Vegito Blue. And then maybe LF Vegito Blue could just, you know, snipe people with his ultimate. Because that does still hit pretty hard to this day. So, yeah, we'll see what happens. Hope you guys enjoy it once again. And I'll see you all in the next one. Time to settle this! Out of the Nothing! 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 Nothing!